All right, guys, we're going to work on correcting some frequently confused words today on IXL. Um, I'll show you my little cheat sheet that I have over here. And that's just because if I don't use these words a lot, I'm not going to remember them when I'm supposed to use them. And so it's a good thing that I practice with you guys. And it's okay if you have a cheat sheet too. Um, let's see. The audience was charmed by the performer who maintained a lively humor and wit throughout his whole act. So I want the thing that means the entire act. This one means like you dig a hole in a ground or there's something missing. Um, this one is entire. So that's the one I want. The last time we were all together was for our grandparents' 50th wedding anniversary celebration in 2012. I get this one confused, so let's look. Two words means in a group, all together means completely. So if I have it as one word, you can probably hear my dog, by the way, she's chewing on a bone. Um, if it's one word, it means that it's completely like I'm all together nervous about doing this where all together as two words means in a group and they're in a group so there we go according to the United States Constitution the president cannot accept or accept a personal gift from a leader from another country without the approval of Congress this means like an exception and this means like to take, so he can't take. As we were driving to Seattle, we passed a sign for a small town named Boring, Oregon. Passed in this case means to go on like, you know, on your left as Captain America would say, um, cause he was passing someone. This means in the past. So something that happened prior. So this is the one that we want. A bowling alley was built in the White House in 1947 for President Harry Truman's birthday. Though he did not bowl himself, he blank his staff to start a bowling league. This allowed means uh, like L-O-U-D means you can hear it. So think of the sound. And this one is allowed like give permission. Oh, this one's easy for me to remember. Desert and dessert. So I have to figure out which one I need first. The blank on Chile's Pacific coast is one of the driest regions on earth. So this means a desert. So something that with lots of sand and heat. Okay, we would want less of that. So there's only one S. With dessert, you want more. So there's two S's. At least that's how I was taught. Jazz Fest is a popular celebration of music and culture in New Orleans. Every year, thousands of people attend the festival to experience its spectacular performances. So I need a possessive because it's like the festival's spectacular performances. The one that is possessive is the one without the apostrophe in this case, which I know is weird. But that's because this one means it is. So, but that one makes sense to experience it is spectacular performances. So I'm going to go with that one. Flight data recorders, also known as black boxes, are required on all commercial flights. Their main purpose is to record important flight information that can be used. So what purpose do they own? They're that for owning is this one. This one means they are, and this one is a location, like over there. So this one is the one that shows ownership. During her reign, the ancient Egyptian pharaoh Hasafut ordered the construction and repair of a great amount or number of temples and monuments. This is on my cheat sheet. Number can be counted. So you could count the number of monuments. So I think that's what it's going to be. Amount is something that's not able to be counted. So like you can't count 
the amount of air in the room. So that would go with amount. The gallery was crowded, but it was also quiet or quite. People were silently admiring, so they want quiet. Okay, this one means quite with the E on the end. The E makes that I long. Okay, this means quiet. You know the difference between the two. Oops, thought I hit that. There we go. People who lay down on their stomachs or lie on their stomachs. Well, we actually use this one wrong all the time or incorrectly. Lay is when you place an object flat. So I lay my keys on the table. I place them on the table. Lie is something that you do. So you don't say, you're not supposed to say, I'm going to go lay down. You're supposed to say, I'm going to go lie down because you're the person that does the actual thing. Evidence suggests that early Egyptians built the pyramids by using simple ramps and levers to rise or raise the massive stone blocks into place. So raise is the one that we're gonna look for here. The yoga instructor told her students to sit down on their mats. Set is like lay and lie. It's sit and set. You sit down, you lie down. Other things are laid down, you lay it down, or you set it on the table. Okay. What would a what effect would a higher global temperature have on Arctic animals like polar bears and seals? So effect in this case means like the outcome, the thing that happens, the noun, where effect in this case means um, how it affects you, like it's the verb. So they're asking what the noun would be. Mandy told her son, if blank trying to save some money, you should eat more meals at home and spend blank money on your, on clothing. So, if you are trying, so I need this your with the apostrophe to save money. So should it, we don't say fewer money, we say less money. So it's going to be that one. If you feel nervous before your speech, I advice or advise. Advice is a thing. Advise is something you do. So we're going to look at these two because it's advise you to take a deep breathe or breath, a deep breath prior to walking on stage. There's a lot of traffic on Third Street because of a car whose tire has blown. The car has been moved to, has already. Okay, so remember our, our already, an adverb before a specific time or already like completely prepared. This one is going to be one of these two. This whose means who is. So there's a lot of traffic on Third Street because of a car who is tire or this one, which is possessive whose. So I think it's this one. We'll see if I'm right. All right. Blank having blank cell phone reception, Joseph's cottage on the lake was is also lacking a landline. Beside or besides having. So I'm going to say besides. This poor is poor like in your face, and this poor means not having a lot of money. So I'm going to go with that one or not having enough. So that would be how that would work there. Okay, so I got that. The inferior vena cava is the largest vein in the body. This means like vanity or like vein, like you like to look at yourself in the mirror type thing. So we're looking for vein from these two. Um, Cause that's like the thing that runs through your body and delivers blood. In animals, blank called the 
So I want it is, so I want it's apostrophe s. Okay. If you find a blank in your clothing, a hole, so I don't want, I'm not going to find a hole like a, the entire thing. I want to say if you find a hole like a missing part in your clothing, let it alone or leave it alone. I think it's leave until you can mend it, otherwise you could make it larger. These black boots are ideal for everyday wear, or he does this every day. So I think I want two different words, like this happens for everyday wear. Hmm, I don't remember this one. Let's see, we'll at least narrow it down. There, so I want they are. So hmm, one of these two, for everyday wear. going to go with this one. I think I might be wrong, though. Nope, I was right. So let's look up the difference between every day versus every day, because I don't remember the difference. Every day is an adjective we use to describe something that's seen or used every day, like the boots. It means ordinary or typical. Every day just means each single day. Okay, good to know. Please be careful when you pour the iced tea. So you don't want the one that means pour in your face. This means pour, P-O-U-R. So I'm looking at this one or this one. If you tip the pitcher too quickly, so this is T-W-O like the number, so I'm going to want this. Okay. Do you think the snowstorm will affect... Remember, effect, when it is an action, starts with an A. Um, and that's what we want here. Effect, so think of like um, a snowstorm might have an effect of closing school. Um, which, oh. Um, so I'm looking for one with an A, any of your, any of you are, or this you are. Okay. And some of these, it's hard for me to explain. I just know them because I've read a lot and I practice it a lot. Okay. People who sit for too many hours during the day, sit for too many hours during the day, Experts advice or advise? Well, experts advise. They give advice. They, they themselves advise. Okay. The Ogallala Aquifer and Underground Water Reservoir, reservoir in the Great Plains region has 9% less water than it had 60 years ago. Then... And then, this one means to compare. I have more shoes than Mr. Hutch. This one means like in time. So I'm going to use this one. It had 9% less water or fewer water. Well, we'll say less. Oh, I used, I flipped my then and then. Oh, because it's comparing, not using time. That was my stupid mistake. Because um, it's comparing what it was like at that time to the time now. It wasn't saying do this, then do that. And I am almost out of time. So there's lots of ways to make mistakes on these. And some of them aren't ones we use very often. But just be patient with yourself. Have a cheat sheet if it'll help you. Um, it helps me on ones that I don't use very often or ones that I know like lay and lie where I use them like they're synonyms when they aren't really. And hopefully that will help you. Good luck.